almonds are the first trees to bloom in the middle of winter, usually in February, and are considered a spring harbinger. Spring is known as the Renaissance period. Almonds represent the hope of a new life, awakening after the cold winter. At the end of February 1992, when almonds were blooming all over the small town of Khojali, it was witnessed how the snow turned into unusual scarlet color. During the Second World War, the mass extermination of Jews is one of the most tragic pages in the world history. The genocide of 6 million people is known as the Holocaust. On June 10, 1944, 642 residents of the village of Ordeur sur Glane in France were brutally murdered. In 100 days, in 1994, one small country becomes a burial place of almost 1 billion people. The name of this Central African state is Rwanda. On July 11, 1995, over 8,000 men and adolescents were killed in a little-known European town, Srebrenica. On the night of February 25, 26, 1992, 613 people, including 106 women and 63 children, were brutally killed in one of the Azerbaijan Republic cities. The city is called Khojale. All of the events mentioned above have one common pattern. Each time the victims belong to a particular ethnic group or nation. Jews in Europe, French in Ottawa, Tutsis in Rwanda, Bosnians in Srebrenica, and Azerbaijanis in Khojale. Khojale Genocide, 26 February 1992. The day of the embodiment of sorrow, the incurable wound in the heart of Azerbaijan. On that snowy February day, hundreds of civilians were murdered brutally. Thousands of dreams were ruined violently by Armenian armed forces. The people, startled by unexpected attack, ran barefoot to the mountains and forests to save their lives. The mountains that they seek escaping turned to the grave for most of them. The forest they turned to for salvation become their death causation. The snow that brings joy to us today was a curse of the Khojali people that day. The words are not enough to explain the suffering of Khojali victims. Today we hope that the souls of the mothers, children, those who died of frostbite and torture, and heroes those whose lives ended with a gunshot and all victims we lost in Khojale have found peace, albeit partially, after the victory of Azerbaijani army. We wish God have mercy on the victims of Khojale and patience on the survivors who must live forever with the dreadful memories of that day.